sometimes I don't feel like I'm a Christian. Um, not that I'm not one, but sometimes I don't feel like I'm one. Being a Christian is about uh, loving God. Most of all, it's about God giving. It's not about us taking. Uh, being a Christian is about uh, what you believe in, not so much as what you are at the moment. Um, like, if you get up at 4 o'clock in the morning and uh, somebody's banging at your door and they're drunk, wanting to come in and lay down, and uh, you've been continuing with this person for years and you're so sick of them. And see, what you're feeling like at that moment doesn't necessarily uh, relate to who you really are on the inside. I know there's a lot of times when I get upset that I don't feel like a Christian. Sometimes when I'm doing Christian stuff, I don't feel like a Christian. You know, we sing songs at church and um, sometimes I just don't feel like I'm uh, uh, up to par, you know. I don't feel like, I don't feel like singing sometimes. Sometimes I don't feel like doing this video. A lot of times I don't feel like doing this video, you know. But it's something I've committed my heart to doing. Singing is something I've committed my heart to doing. Preaching is something I've committed my heart to doing. I preach a lot of sermons with a headache. And sometimes I preach, I preach a sermon that is... Um, is not what I uh, try to think of what I want to say here. I'll be in somebody else's church preaching a sermon. And the sermon that I'm preaching is not really um, what I want to preach. It's, what, it's always what God wants to, me to preach. But it's not what I necessarily want to preach, you know. I want to preach healing. I want to preach deliverance. And I don't want to just preach it, but I want to be a part of when God's doing it, you know. I want God to move heavily in every sermon that I preach. But it don't always happen that way, you know. Uh, when you got little kids running around your house and screaming and yelling and throwing things and and uh, you just clean the house up the day before and it looks like you haven't touched it in a month you know you don't, you don't feel much like a Christian when that kind of stuff like that is going on but that doesn't mean that you're not a Christian because being a Christian is not about feeling like you are one as a matter of fact it's a lot of times it's quite the opposite. Becoming, being and becoming a Christian is about uh, following a different way. Sometimes the sinners, they get mad at you because you think you're Mr. Uppity, so it is in their mind, you know. But in reality, you're not really you're not really better than they are. Excuse me, just a minute. Okay, I thought I was going to sneeze. Okay. Anyways, you're not really better than any of those. You just, um, in a spiritual sense, yeah, but in a physical sense you're the same old person that you 
always were. You just decided to follow a different direction. And because you do, you get favor from God. Yes, you get favor from God. The Bible tells us that when our ways please Him, you know, the Lord pours out stuff on you. And sometimes it's some good stuff. A lot of times it's good stuff. But we follow this way not because we feel like it. Because we follow it because we know it's the right thing to do. And because we know that God is God. you got just got to get to know Him. And it helps you get through some rough times. You know, God's, I think it was Chuck Swindoll that said that we're like a rubber band that that God stretches out sometimes and God likes to test that um, breaking point where that he's just trying to get a rubber band where it's going to stretch more that's not the way he said it he's more eloquent than I am but that's you know God's trying to make us grow that's what he was saying and he has a good way of doing it and sometimes when you you won't always feel like a Christian when you're growing. Amen. God bless. See you again next time. Cross the moment. Another great subject.